We keep the distance races going here in the War and Fire Stairs Handicap on the all-weather. Two miles, five furlongs distance, and we actually got a pretty good size field here. Usually, I get like five horses in these late Wednesday all um, long distance races, and I'm just recounting stories of my childhood here. But 12 horses, I think that's a new record for me. Um, so we will see. <laughs> Uh, one of my favorite notes here is on Warrior 1, uh, better not be beaten by a freaking horse named Mr. Ed. So, Mr. Ed, I hope you win here over Warrior 1, but all regards to the track, they're off and running in the War and Fire Stairs Handicap. So, Warrior 1, for a serious chill racing, goes right to the lead. Gold Cup sits in second, optimally named for this uh, start. Then it's Custom Made and Keys. Mr. Ed, the rival of Warrior 1 in serious chill racing, Sits there in the fifth, and Black Car and Salient, really. Kings Carosa is there behind them with Chili Holiday. And then it's Spanish Steps, Free Future, and Pixley, the trailer. They head past the Grandstands for the first time. It's Warrior One leading by about four lengths over Gold Cup. It was a length in front of Custom Made. Keys sits in fourth. And then it's Mr. Ed and Salient, really. Black cars behind them. Kings Carosa is next. And it's Chili Holiday. Free Future in Spanish Steps with Pixley, our trailer. So, just over two miles to go in this long distance affair. I haven't started recounting stories of my childhood just yet. There's enough horses for me to concentrate on the racing. But we'll see how we go with one lap around. So Warrior 1 leading by about four lengths as we go over to the pond here in, in the center of the Kempton course. So with the water backdrop behind us, Warrior 1 leads by four. Gold Cup sits in second. Keys is in third. A length ahead of Custom Made. Then it's Salient really on the outside. Black car between horses. Mr. Red's next. Then it's Salient. Uh, then it's Kings Carosa. With Chili Holiday and Free Future, Spanish Steps is next, and then a couple lengths back to the back marker, Pixley. So it's Warrior 1 out by 4, running very well in the yellow silks, just striding on by and leading them into the 12 furlongs as we head around another turn. It's Warrior 1 leading, Gold Cup sits in 2nd. Keys is in third, Kings Carosa next, Black Car behind them with Chili Holiday and Custom Made. Then it's Mr. Ed and Salient, really, Spanish Steps is still there, Free Future is there, and Pixley is still our trailer. As I tell you, the exact same order pretty much the whole way around. So ten and a half furlongs to go, it's a merry-go-round round, round race thus far. Round and round they go, who will be up in front at the end? Warrior One's there now, passing the car park and heading into the stretch and passing the grandstand for the second of three trips. So we'll be going around one more time here at Kempton as we head past the stands. A very light crowd here. The rain scared a lot of them off here at Kempton, but it will still be Warrior One out in front, not really caring for this rain whatsoever, just not even bothering with it. So it's Warrior 1 out by two lengths. Now Keys has changed things, and Mr. Ed moves into third. Mr. Ed's running well. Gold Cup's there in fourth. Chili Holiday sits in fifth. We got some mixing up in the top five. Kings Kuros is behind them in sixth. Then it's Spanish Steps in seventh. Black Cars on the outside in eighth with Free Future. Then it's Salient, really, and Custom Made. And no change with our back marker. Pixley is still trailing. So six furlongs to go. It's a sprint to the finish, and it's Warrior 1 trying to hold off the onslaught, but Mr. Ed is moving well. Mr. Ed is trying to challenge Warrior 1. It's Serious Chill's worst nightmare. Warrior 1 and Mr. Ed on front. Keys is sitting next, and it's Chili Holiday and Gold Cup. Black car behind them, Spanish steps next with Kings Carosa and Free Future. Salient really is moving on the outside, then Custom Made and Pixley's trying to pick up a couple horses, but still the back marker. Three and a half furlongs to go, Warrior One's leading over Mr. Ed. The two of them are now locking horns, Mr. Ed's drawing alongside. It's Warrior One and Mr. Ed, a match race made in heaven. Mr. Ed now leading over 
by a head over Warrior One, but Warrior One's fighting back. The two of them are quick out in front. A fur almost uh, two furlongs to go with Mr. Ed out in front over Warrior One. Keys is behind them with Black Car, but the two of them are leading them in the dust. It's Mr. Ed and Warrior One that are there dueling neck and neck, nose and nose. Warrior One, Mr. Ed, Warrior One's fighting ahead in front. Here comes Black Car on the outside. Mr. Ed's trying to fight on again. Warrior One, Warrior One, Warrior One dug down deep and beat his nemesis, Mr. Ed. A nightmare to a dream for a serious chill racing. Took the top weight. And beats Mr. Ed. Keys finished in third to finish out the trifecta. So, Warrior won over Mr. Ed. Keys in third, Black Car in fourth. And all's well in the day for Serious Trail Racing. A gate to wire victory.